Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome back to my channel. It's Jay over at Slow Ride Model Cars. Um, haven't really done much. Uh, I've been at physical therapy for my left knee that I had surgery on. So I really wasn't getting around much. Wasn't really going down the basement. Uh, the weather's been kind of crappy, so I couldn't really paint much. So I had this uh, torque trike I bought from Ollie's. And... Uh, I really was going to just use it as a parts vehicle. I like the rear tires, oversized tires, and the rims. I figured I could use that on some kind of car model. Uh, the slicks are actually there, like a red line slick. So they were pretty cool looking. And uh, I could use the injector stacks for another model that I have in the works in my head anyway. So I just let it sit around and said, you know what, let me, let me build it anyway. So, uh, so let's take a look at it. So oh, there it is. Bring it up a little closer. So that's it. Um, the rear tires, they're off of something else. They're old. They're probably 35 years old. Old school. Um, I know the bearded guy, Jeff, he had built one a while back ago. And I forgot what headers he used, if he used the ones that came with the kit. Because the headers that came with the kit, they were going into the body. You see on the box, it doesn't really show that. It kind of looks like they're going over the fenders, but they're not. They wanted them to make them look like they were going into the body. And then in the back, they had these little chrome things going down, like the exhaust is going through the fender. I didn't really like that. So I found these headers laying around in a parts box. And I just heated them up and bent them down, almost gasser style. I uh, painted it with um, two coat, two colors. I striped it. First time I ever striped anything. So uh, I was just playing around with it. It's dupla color maroon and dupla color gold. Got a regular basic small block Chevy in it, but. You know, it's it's a show rod when it comes down to it. And, uh, you know, you imagine this thing in real life. All the weight that's right here on this part. One little wheelie comes down. You're going to bend that. How does a guy even get into this trike? Climb all over it to get in? But I, I thought that was funny. But, uh, yeah, so I uh, I did the stripes taped them off that's underneath painted the engine gold the head is like blacked out the end of it and like I said the rims get my fingers out of the way the rims are old the tires are old but they're even with the the back fenders they're not sticking out They gave you uh, different color lenses for the back window and the headlights. I just chose to use the clear one. And got a little uh, skull and crossbone decal there. Painted the interior like a beige color. It's got the shifter in it. It's hard to see way down in there, but there's some pedals, clutch pedal and stuff. Don't mind my shaking. That's the rumble of the small block Chevy engine. But, uh, yeah. So, speaking of the back window. The back window that they gave you, I tried to put it in. When I put it in, it falls right through. All three of them. All colors that I tried. They all fell right in. So, I said, you know what? It doesn't need a back window. So, I didn't use that. Um, it was a little tedious getting the engine in, the rear end, the fork, because the fork, you have to, the body's in two halves, so you have to glue the rest of it together, and you leave the front, I guess, unglued, and then after you paint it, then you put the fork in, that's the way I did it anyway, opened it up, put the fork in, squeezed it back together with some crazy glue, and, uh, 
it didn't do too bad. That's a decal on top. Those little squares, that's a decal. The rest, like I said, is paint. And you can get a little shot of the petals. But, uh, yeah, not much. Still rolls. I got a will probably roll off the shelf. But, like I said, that's really all I've done. I, uh, I have the, uh, Terry Sr. car in prime so far, the one I'm building for that. I just have it in prime. Like I said, I've been waiting for the weather to break. And, uh, I've been working on the Jaguar, little pieces and stuff. Again, waiting to paint the body, get started on that. So, that's about it. So, like I said, I didn't have much. Figured I'd show you this. Uh, wasn't the greatest model, but it passed a little bit of the time. So, uh, so that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. And, uh, thanks for watching. Talk to you later.